Hello and welcome back to Coins and More UK. I hope everyone is having a fantastic week and in today's video we are looking at the latest coin release by the Royal Mint. I'm sure a lot of you have already heard about this but we did have a new coin set release um, just last week by the Royal Mint and of course it is the eagerly awaited Winnie the Pooh sets. So of course, um, starting off with this one, there is going to be 9 coins in total, and this one is the first. So we're going to have 3 releases each year. So we've got 3 for 2020, 3 for 2021, and the last 3 in 2022. Which is really cool, and uh, I can't wait to see what designs will be on the coins next. I'm hoping to see um, possibly an Eeyore or a Tigger, I can't wait for them coins. But for now, this is the first one, and of course it is the gorgeous Winnie the Pooh. Okay, so let's get into the coin. Let's uh, rip this open, so you don't have to at home. Okay, so I'm going to take this out nicely. Put you over there. There we go. It's really nice. Not a bad design at all, I can't wait to see the rest. And the booklet's quite cool as well. Nice and simple, just um, a few folds. And on the back, just there, we've got the uh, the obverse. 2020, Winnie the Pooh, some really nice illustrations again. And of course, we've got a bit of information about Winnie the Pooh and friends. So Pooh's house, Pooh lives in a house under the name of Sanders. Caring friends. And again, some lovely illustrations. Feel free to pause the video if you do want to have a quick read. I'm not going to read it all. And of course, we've got some information about the 100 acre wood. Isn't it funny how a bear likes honey? And of course, honey being Winnie the Pooh's favourite food. I've got a little map of the 100 acre wood there as well, which is really, really cool. Some really nice, simple illustrations. It's a really nice booklet. It's simple, but it's effective. It's really nice. And again, a bit of information about Pooh Bear as well. A long time ago, a bear of uh, very little brain bumped down the stairs into our world. He loves honey, Christopher Robin and all his friends. He is known for his hums, tucking into smack of holes, and for getting into all sorts of sticky spots. We all know and love Winnie the Pooh. And there we have some, some of the specifications again that we uh, went through at the beginning of the video. Yeah, really nice. A nice, simple, nice, simple um, little pamphlet there that you get with the coin. Really, really nice. And then we have one more shot of the coin. What I didn't, what I've also noticed as well is the new Royal Mint logo. I really, really like this. I do prefer it to the old logo, and it's really nice. It does look really cool. Simple, bold, pretty much all the same colour. And they've got the coat of arms up the top as well. But obviously we've got the Royal Mint, the original maker. But yeah, it's a really nice logo. Um, this improved packaging, um, bulk pack, it's, it's really cool. It's, it's certainly made an impression on me. The coin isn't my favourite or uh, release of this year, but I do like the coin and I will be collecting all nine. So if you do want to get your hands on one, head over to the Royal Mint website or Change Checker or, or Westminster. And you can pick these up for uh, a variety of prices depending on uh, what you want, whether the Royal Mint Bunk or the Change Checker, change checker Cards. But yeah, really cool stuff and I'm, I'm quite happy with this. It's really, really nice. Okay, so there we have it for another packaged coin review from the Royal Mint. If you did enjoy this video, please leave me a like. And of course, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, that would be absolutely fantastic as well. If you press that notification bell, you will always be notified when I upload new videos like this. Um, all that's really left for me to say now is, um, of course, also if you want to leave me a comment as well, let me know if you've got this coin, what you think. Um, I do love reading through your comments. So yeah, that'd be fantastic as well. But all that's really left for me to say now is um, thank you so much for watching. And always remember, as always, there's always two sides to every coin if you take the time to look.